Here's tips and tricks with Tyler and Terry. SP slope sensor calibration. What's, What's up, up Donnie? Donnie? Oh, hey guys, how's it going? Pretty good. Uh, hey guys, Austin with Work and Slip Form Service here. Hey. I felt a disturbance in the force, so <laughs> I'm curious, what's going on? Okay, I'm actually glad you're here then. Uh, I've got 0% up here on my display, but that's not matching my curb. Gotcha, gotcha. Well, we got a simple fix for this. All right. Let me help you out. We're going to do a slope sensor calibration. All right. Tyler, do you mind? Nope, I don't. You can do put we... that level on the top of that mold. All right, right here in the back. Yes, sir. So I just put it on the back of the mold and let you know when it's flat. That's exactly right. So I'm going to go up top and you just help guide me to flat. All right. Sweet. Anything we can do to it. Mm-hmm. All right, we're ready when you are. Awesome. Just tell us which way to go. All right, you need to bring the left side of the machine down. All right, Donnie, let's make the manual adjustment to our slope leg. All right. Oh, all right, that's good. Okay, now all we need to do is zero out the slope sensor. That's right. going to be in the M2 menu. Okay. Scroll down one page. There we go. You see your slope sensor symbol there? Yes, sir. Enter button. Okay. Now that it's selected, hit enter again. And you can hit the up or down arrow to zero it. All right. Perfect. Enter to lock it in and escape. There we go. Hey man, you did it. Awesome, thank you. Let's pour some curb. Let's do it. 